Hello everyone, and welcome back to Kingdom Two Crowns. Last time, we were about to be attacked, but I believe we were getting ready to further expand. And maybe start taking a portal. Kingdom is the type of game that it's it's kind of weird to come back to after several days of not playing. Because a lot of what you do in Kingdom is just kind of... Hard to describe. You kind of just get into a flow when you play, you know? Yes, I do believe the left side is the cliff, and the right side is the dock? Is that what it is? No, I don't seem to have any further towers out here on the left. If the left side was the cliff, I'd have more towers. So the left side is definitely the portal, or the, the dock, I mean. Also, it's really hard to tell when it's raining where the position of the sun is, and that's generally how you tell time in this game. Hi, dear. So the portal's right there. We already have our two squires. Honestly, we can start attacking as soon as their attack is over. We'll build up some more coins. Hunt for me! By the way, do you guys have all the coins you need? Yeah, you're good. Okay, night is definitely almost upon us. Oh, I didn't give you your coin. Yeah, get out of here, you scamp. Fetch me more coins, trader! Ply your trade! Oh, hi there. Looks like we've got our full squires on this side. I don't know if squire is the actual name. They're probably just knights, but not upgraded knights, but I call them squires. They haven't earned their swords! They just have little maces. They have maces, yeah, yeah, okay. Never actually looked closely. Oh, hi there. Why don't you grab a spear? Now that we have access to them. Alright, let's go get into position for the left side attack. They probably already fended it off. The portal was not far. Nope. There they go. Just two? Just two. Now, this is the first time doing attacks on this playthrough, so I will just kind of explain my general strategy. They're a lot easier once you have the archer statue, because your archers are just that much more efficient. But basically what you want to do, once they get here, of course. Come on, guys, you can do it. You never want to stay too close to the portal because it might activate and start spitting out a goon. Generally, if you can see it, go back a little bit further, like about here. All right, now that they're here, I'm just going to drop a... Oh, bad decision. Right about where the squires are, you just want to drop a bunch of coins and then get out of there. As the as your units take hits, they're gonna drop some of their coins, uh, which is why you always want to make sure you feed your knights slash squires with as many coins as you can. As long as there's coins there for them to pick up, they'll do so. Sometimes the coins lost like that. 
that happens for me. Once we have the griffin, which is the best now, uh, you can do a wing flap that pushes units back, uh, enemies back. And you want to be careful about doing that because you can bunch them up too much, but uh, it's a great way to kind of keep the heat off your people while they work. Portal is now destroyed. Trigger an immediate counterattack. Ooh, hi there. Get in my village! Which side is it going to come from? You'd think it would come from the left, but it's not a guarantee. Hard to say which side, but... As long as our people can get back safe, we're fine. Sometimes, if the other portal is like right next to that one, uh, you might have to puppy guard them home by just like hemorrhaging coins for the reelings to tank. Are they coming from this side? Right side might be getting hammered. Bark dog. I don't know. Just want to see if they're coming. Hello? Is anybody home? Yeah, they are definitely hitting the right instead. That's the stable hermit. Not a super useful one, but it can help late game or if you're playing co op. Certain strats could revolve around having the stables. Basically, having a stables collects all of your unlocked mounts in one place, wherever you place the stables. Yeah, it definitely came from the, uh, the right. Um, and there are, like, a few mounts that can be very useful to switch to for defensive versus, you know, going far versus, like, attacking a portal, whatever. But... I feel like that would be more of a co-op strat. I've never actually played co-op for, for this game, despite that being like one of the main additions for Two Crowns. I have a few friends who have the game, so I'll probably try and do a co-op playthrough with maybe a few of them at some point. But for now, we got this. Alright, so honestly, if it weren't so late in the day, because reprisal attacks kind of pause what time of day it is. So if the attack reprisal happens right before the end of the day, it's still right before the end of the day when it's over. And your people all run inside, so... You gotta be really careful about not forgetting that when it's time. How are you guys? Did you get hit hard? Probably not. I think I had you pretty defensive. Ah yeah, we have a triple tower here. Really, we want that tower to be... Um, oh, hi there. We want it to be at least uh, uh, an iron tower because it's got covers. Right now it's vulnerable to flyers. But it's only island two, we're okay. Next time we come back to this island, we'll have iron, most likely. Because I'm pretty sure we got everything we needed out of... Farmer statue would be nice, but I, if I recall correctly, in fact, let's just kind of find out here. I'm not going to pick them up, I just want to see how many I have. Two. We have the coins for it. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. We've got seven. Okay. Now, let's take a quick peek here. What do we have on Island One? We've got Griffin, Baker, and 
archer statue. Griffin's three. Archer's four. Is Griffin three? If Griffin is two, then we can afford the farmer statue. I'll take a quick peek. I'll come right back and let you know. All right. Well, it looks like the archer statue is actually three and the griffin is two which means that's only five it's a baker hermit that's four which makes sense because the bakery is vital late game um i think we will grab the farmer statue seeing as we can't grab the baker right now anyways we're gonna have to come back to island one later uh probably Maybe even after Island 3. It, it, we'll see where we are in the seasons. It might be safer to winter in Island 1. But okay. So we're going to grab the Baker statue, which was on the left-hand side. And we are... We should also get going for a left-hand attack. The sooner we can get that side completely cleared of enemy threat, the sooner we don't have to worry about it. can focus on the right. That's why I always try and clear the dock side portal, uh, even if I'm not dealing with the other side at all. And then, you know, once Island 4 passes, we get access to iron and we can actually destroy the cliffside portals. Then we can start clearing the islands, but for now, at least clear the docks. Oh, and build our fast travel network. Oh. You know what? We've got time. We can go grab a gem. Dock portals are usually tougher in health than regular portals. Also, you can't get close to them, otherwise they tentacle whip you. Giggity. But, they, we should still get back for support as soon as we can. We are just running all the way to the right side of our kingdom. No biggie. We needed the coin up anyway. Hi, girl. I'll see you later. Uh, actually, you know what? One thing you do have to worry about once islands start getting longer, and I think we did kind of time this poorly, is sometimes the nightly attack can hit while your people are still moving. Which, unless you're there to support them, or you're sending a massive attack, usually means they're kind of fucked. Thankfully, this is built so we can get over as soon as possible. Hey guys. I told you I'd beat you there. Okay, the portal's not active, so the night attack hasn't come yet. We are standing a bit too close, but that's fine. God, maybe the night attack did come, and these guys are just that much of a badass. Yeah, one did take a hit, so they might have actually faced down the attack. Good for them. Once you destroy the dock portal, uh, you can make a lighthouse, which you can only make up to your currently, you know, currently highest resource level. But uh, making a lighthouse means that uh, for the wooden, it's a 33% chance of your boat not being destroyed when you return to the island. Stone is 66%, and iron is 100%. We have stone. It's 
so that means when we come back to Island 2, we'll have a 2 out of 3 chance to not have to rebuild the boat. Come on guys, you can do it! Destroy that portal! God, I'm looking forward to having the archer statue. For those of you who haven't played Kingdom or uh, haven't in a while, you will see why uh, as immediately after we get it. Having the statues for any of the classes just makes them so much better. You! And I will say, um, I haven't gotten to experience it because I just never get it. But I really appreciate that they massively buffed the Knight Statue. Uh, before what the Knight Statue did is it made them have this like lunging attack, which while it's damaging, usually meant that they'd rush past enemy lines and get themselves immediately killed. Which is like... pain, you know? Uh, instead, from what I hear, it now... Oh, I should do some grazing. Instead, I hear what it is now is that they just have, like, increased resistance to attack, more damage, and they hit faster, that kind of stuff, which makes way more sense. Just makes them a more effective combat unit. Also, Pikeman statue when... Oh, that's the... the stable hermit. That's not what I meant to buy. I didn't actually check to see how expensive the farmer hermit is. I think it's I think it's also one. It would make sense if it was one. Hey guys, how's it going? Wow, it's going really well, damn. You love to see it. Did the I take it the attack hasn't come yet then. Okay, okay, coins, you can stop, stop, oh, stop. Oh, okay, I guess the attack's over. If I remember correctly, this side does not have portals. Just the cliff. Hi doggo. What were you doing? Are you having a good time? I hope so. The survival of this doggo is 100% not guaranteed. Ah, there we go. Also one, okay. Farmer statue, activate! Woo, okay, there is a portal. I think the cliff is like immediately after it though. That's fine. We're not here to attack anything on the right. In fact, we're probably going to leave now. Like I say, we've got pretty much everything we need out of Island 2 for now. We'll come back once we have the capability of actually destroying the greed on this island. Boat is built. We have. We're going back to. Island. Okay, what day are we on? 23. 15 on this island. So the season's about to change? No, we're in summer right now. I think we experienced that not too long ago. Okay. We're gonna want to be really quick on Island One. Like we're we're gonna want to get in, get out. We'll want as much time on Island Three as possible, because either we will be wintering on Island Three after having been there a while, or we will be about ready to leave right before winter hits. In which case, we can winter on Island 
one. No. No, we'll want a winter on Island 3. Absolutely. It's not often I get to have the boat inside walls. So it's kind of nice to see how fast it's being filled. Alright, do we have everyone? It looks like we have... I can't see how many squires. Oh, more archers are coming. Oh, they're just going there. Oh, yeah, okay, here come the other two squires. I think as soon as they get on, we can... Oh, only one more gone on. I guess we already had two. Alright, well, let's get out of here, guys. We don't have any hermits yet, sad. Uh, dog. Oh, okay, go. <laughs> oh, the dog was just staying behind. I'm like, dude. All right, Island 3, that is lovely, but we need to go back to Island 1 for a short spell. We didn't have the dock portal destroyed, so yeah, the ship's down. <laughs> Hi. I don't even remember what side the dock portal was here. But, before I get carried away, that is an excellent spot to leave it for today. Next time, we will be blitzing through Island 1 and hopefully getting set up on Island 3. Thank you to everyone for joining me. If it is your first time here, please consider subscribing. I've got way more content like this coming out very soon. Later.